In 1994, waters of Lugacho Lake in northern Bhutan burst through their natural dam and cascaded downstream. Many people, as well as homes, livestock, and valuable food stores were lost in the resulting flash flood. Hundreds of acres of agricultural land were destroyed or rendered unusable by the rapid erosion in some places and deposition of sand and flood debris in others. Ridges were washed away and many religious and historic sites were heavily damaged. To understand the significance of the 1994 flood, we need to understand the geography and geology of Bhutan. Bhutan is a small kingdom in Asia. Its neighbors include India, China, Nepal, and Bangladesh. The majority of Bhutan is mountainous. The country climbs in elevation from the foothills of the Himalayas in the south to their highest altitudes in the north. Seasonal monsoons drop snow in the northern mountains, which feed the many rivers that flow south through Bhutan's valleys. This is one of the areas in northern Bhutan in which the annual snowfall accumulates into glaciers. These glaciers make their way down their valleys until they reach lower, warmer elevations where they melt. The meltwater feeds Bhutan's rivers and makes life possible along the bottom of the narrow valleys. Meltwater also accumulates to form lakes behind moraines, which are loose debris piles that naturally form at the leading edge of melting glaciers. While the moraines may cause large lakes to form, they are inherently unstable. Throughout the Himalayas, flash floods of extreme magnitude occur when such moraine is breached by rising water, earthquakes, or destabilized by human activity. The resulting flood is called a glacial lake outburst flood, or GLOF. In Bhutan, increasing global temperatures are increasing the rate at which glaciers melt. Glacial lakes are filling more rapidly, and moraines are bursting more often. Outburst floods were a serious problem for the people of Bhutan because most of the population lives in the valleys near the rivers that flow from the, gl the glacial lakes. Warming temperatures ensure that more floods will occur, and the limited inhabitable lands in Bhutan virtually guarantee that the people living there will not avoid all the effects of these floods. In recent years, the government of Bhutan, in cooperation with the United Nations and other organizations, has worked to identify those glacial lakes that pose the greatest threat for future outburst flood events. Each summer, groups of workers travel to the identified lakes and, using only hand tools, build spillways to allow water from the glacial lakes to run downstream safely and reduce the pressure on the moraine dams. Large machinery is not used for these projects because of the high likelihood that the added weight or vibration near the moraines would actually cause an outburst flood. While efforts of these workers will not stop all floods, these workers hope to reduce the resulting damage by reducing lake levels before flood events occur. Thank you.